We got boss. Why don't you cover yourself up? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, man. Wake up, princess. Hello, beautiful. Hello, princess. Wakey, wakey. Yo guys, so our beautiful Amiru has finally woken up. Oh, you have to get breakfast here. Oh, get some, get some bread, get some bread. We bought some egg tarts and Amiru started eating. How is it? Oh, it's good. Uh. It's cheap and good. Uh. Has it woken you up? Yep, definitely. We have woken up the princess. Good finally. source of sugar and carbs. And so <laughs> Never mind. Okay, hey, so man. the plan today is we are going to visit the fort. And we are going to go up the fort. But I don't think... Like we are able to cover Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think over there. I will have... What? Over there? Yeah. Oh. I want the party place. Okay. But anyway, we were unable to go to the fort yesterday. So we're gonna go right now. Oh my hair is a mess. But we are gonna go there now. And we're gonna check out the place. I'm gonna show you the fort. It's called uh, Fort Monte. M-O-N-T-E. I love you guys. Follow me on um, Instagram. A-M-I capital W-U-L. A M I capital W U L. Follow yeah. me, man. Follow me also at Lord underscore of underscore God. Underscore. Thanks. Yeah, that's it. Guys, so we at the, the ruins of St. Paul again. Bam. In the full the full glory of the morning light. Trying out some freaking eight tarts. Bloody good man. The crust is very well done. And the custard is awesome. One custard like a, around like 80 cents Singapore dollar. First one is like five bucks. Oh by the way, they will always give it the change in Macau dollars, so use it before you leave this place. Yeah, depends on where you go actually. But they'll give you a lot of Macau dollars. Mom post me. Okay, so this is the inside of the of the the ruins. Apparently you can go up. And then out there that's the entrance and then you go in from here. Apparently like it's open like now. So you can check out check around. Look what's around here. But it's pretty dull because it's just like one entire wall wall of structure. Okay. Yeah. So apparently this is the old chapel complex. Uh, the rooms over here. So we have like an entire chapel around here. And we actually throw money down there. I don't know where you can see it. There's like cash. Like banknotes. People are rich nowadays man. But yeah, there's like banknotes there in order to I think, I think it's for the religion or something like that. Yeah, just to pay like some tribute and stuff. So, yeah. The entrance over here is free. So you can come over anytime. And it's really good to visit around. Very interesting stuff. And there's this like mini spot here. The Museum of Sacred Art. There's like all the artifacts. The chapel itself, free of charge to go in. Mm -hmm. So this guy from, from your class? Yep. So basically, Richie, he was uh, spreading Christianity in China. Macau. Okay. Just just some yeah. context. Yeah. This guy. Basically, and basically yeah, he said that uh, this guy is a padre, padre Matteo Durich. I want to be intellectual, bro. I want to be intellectual. I want to show off my intellectual knowledge, bro. Uh, hurry so, up. Yeah. So basically, this guy. I right, want to eat yeah, the pasta. This guy, right? He said that it's okay for you to pray to your ancestors, but in Christian in Christianity, you can never pray to your ancestors. It's considered wrong. You know, it's considered haram. Yeah, haram or huge sin. But this guy said can until some missionary came 50 years later and complained to the church. Complain to the Pope and the Pope said you you have totally changed the teachings of Christianity and you are doomed to hell. So he he 
he actually said that uh, people are able to pray to their ancestors. Yeah, because which is yeah. which is also like which commonly is, known as like the Confucius belief. Yep, like this guy is uh, and the embodiment of uh, of the syncretism between Confucianism and maybe Taoism and also Christianity. Yep, yeah. So that's why he was uh, he was blamed by the church. Yep, but in a in a sense, like he also created something yeah. new. So this guy, he, he this guy, right? We see, uh, yeah, yeah, he, yeah. He was claimed. He was claimed as uh, heresy because he combined the teachings of uh, Confucianism and Christianity, and he allowed veneration of the ancestors, lah, which is not allowed actually Christianity. So awesome, he combined awesome. both lah to, to attract people to join Christianity And because of him right Christianity actually spread in China Until the Pope condemned him I see Cool cool It's a, it's a very yeah, What a smart guy bro very, Can you fish me? Yeah, yeah, important figure actually Indeed yeah, Everyone should learn about him eh. Everyone should Everyone should learn about him So look at our dear army Wu fanboying over him yeah. What a man What a man bro What a man Come smile Yeah boy Whoop whoop hey, Whoop whoop I want, whoop, to, I want, to, I want you to take a video of me Yeah I already took one No like, like, like using my phone Okay This cannon is aimed at, supposed to be aimed at the sea because the Portuguese tried to fend off the Dutch and they don't really have cannons facing the mainland. And yet, the funny thing is, right now in modern times, it's aiming at this like like hotel here or like this casino. I have no idea what is it. Is that a casino or a hotel? Casino. It's casino, right? Yeah. Yeah, it's aiming there. Look. Bam. Irony, man. Down with capitalism, bitch. What can you say? Down with capitalism. Oh, sh Oh shit man! Yo, my man! Oh, okay guys, so to give you a sense of where we are, right? It's the museum. And then that's the, the ruins of St. Paul. I think we stay around somewhere around there. And uh, that's the further islands down south, like Taipa in this area. That's the casino area and that's Macau Tower, I think. And over the wat waterway, that's too high. That's mainland China, just opposite there. Opposite the water. Yeah. Pretty So basically, I've got to tell you guys this That, that area there, that you can see that, that whole forest area I think that's Fort Gia That's like the second fort In Macau there are three forts One is Mon Monche Gia Which is that one And then the third one is Mount Laos That one is very rarely visited People mainly visited, visit these two forts Gia and Monche But this is the this gear, I think. Okay, guys, so we are in the museum. Bam, the top level seems to be closed, so we couldn't enter there. But, but from here, that's the, that's the actual museum. This is my boy. Yep, we are exploring hotel. So By the way, guys, this ticket is like cheaper as compared to like adult versus student. So if you are a student and you come here, you only pay like 8 Macau pesos which is about I think 1.2 Singapore dollars around there. And for the adults, I think it's 12 which is about 2 bucks. Yeah. Museum in the fort itself. Sex bro. Solid. Shall we
you guys, check out their luggage man. Like, like it's like shape L. Then it's for kids to ride on it. Oh my god. Come here, there's, the first time is 6pm, so take note of that, the museum, yeah. Okay, so while I'm on an escalator going down from the museum, on the top of the fort, which has a museum, down to the bottom of the fort, I'm going to explain a few things. So, if you want to use the toilet, the toilet here is good. And second thing, the price of the ticket over here, to go into the museum, is very worth it. It's about 2 Singapore dollars if you're a student. I think even lesser than that. Yeah, so it's, only like, it's, it's, it's only like one dollar fifty cent, one sixty Singapore dollars. And there's a lot of history inside. It's almost like a mini Asian civilization museum. It's like smaller, but it's really good. It's really worth visiting. So you can check it out. Definitely go and check it out if you have the time. Estimated amount of time to visit around this place around like two hours. Yeah, one, yeah, two, one if, to two hours. If you're a person that studies history a lot and like likes to read things, I will suggest two hours. Yeah. Yeah, like you bro. Yeah, like me actually. Yeah. Like us, like us. Yeah, like us lah. About two yeah. hours for us. Solid. Love bro. Love. Love you more. I love you more than I can say. Yo guys, so I have... What? Sorry? Oh, okay. Later, later. Yo guys, so anyway, I'm gonna end this particular video here. And then we're gonna continue on another video which will eventually lead us to Gia Fortress. Not a lot of people go to this place. Everybody goes to Monche Fort. Yeah, and there's a museum there. So it's kind of like convenient to go there. So nobody really enters Gia Fortress, but we are on our way there now. So stay tuned. Anyway, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Now to sign out, be sure to subscribe, like, comment, share and turn on the notification bell for more videos to come. Love you guys 3000 and I'm you, any words? I love you guys. Sex bro, see you, fam. Let me show you. Hey, hello. Huh? What you want, huh? I want your money. Huh? Who do you think you are? You better get out of the way, you son of a bitch.